He holds a purple heart. Please give a Viking welcome to Senator Brian Burke. I was 15 to 20 yards from where the nose of Flight 77 makes penetration at the Pentagon. By the Lord's grace, I'm the only survivor in the E-ring at the crash site. I was a 60% total body burn, 40% of my body is a third degree burn. I never should have survived. It doesn't matter where you are on the battlefield, it's that you raised your right hand, said I'll support and defend the Constitution of the United States against all enemies, foreign and domestic, and that you're prepared to potentially not just give a limb not just give an eye, but to potentially give your life in the defense of the freedoms that we enjoy in this country. We have an obligation to support parents and teach those young men and women to appreciate the sacrifice of those that are serving them. Uh, and that's why it was so important to be here today. My favorite part was when, when they all came in and they were so proud and when we started singing the, like the song. Children need to learn and we need to keep instilling that in them to recognize what we have here is freedom and it's not, it's not free. Let us never again forget the price paid, whether you think that, that that conflict is appropriate or not. Don't ever let the, the service and sacrifice, the pain and suffering, don't ever let that suffering go unappreciated. Because of the, the Army, the military, the people who serve, we're free. They're out there, there's people out there right now. And uh, if it wasn't for all those in the past that have gone before us, we wouldn't be here right now.